What's up, YouTube? How are we all doing today? Oh, man, I still feel out of whack. Oh, that one's in. <laughs> that's why that's back. Okay. Got a haul video for y'all today. Haven't had one in a while. Thought I'd do one. So, first off, we're going to get on ahead and get over to Meyer, which I did pick up. <laughs> Actually, I had some new comics. <laughs> comics, comics. And funny enough, these are cheaper than Wally Worlds. Five bucks. You do get three. Actually, how many do you get? I think three books. And they actually do. This pack here really felt thick and new. Because this was. Because I think I got Contest of Champions number one in here. Hold on, I got another number one. But it does not look like it. So, I'll crack her open and see what it is. I'm going to do this on day because I went ahead and did the. Oh, crap, I didn't get in there. Well, I'm going to do it in another way. <laughs> The scary way. Snip, snip. <laughs> How many men gets here of that sound, right? Okay, I hope I don't accidentally grab two number one. Another number one. So, okay, first off, go to the back. Sometimes I think these are back to back. This one isn't this time. So we got Avengers. Oop. I got so much stuff down there. So we got. Ooh, okay. <laughs> well, I got this, so yeah. Amazing Spider Man oversized. Number one. I do have a copy of this. There's a lot of pretty good little extra stories in here. We got, um, I think there's a Miles Morales. In here, yep. Spidey 2099. Put this down here. So, you got a little Spidey 2099, a little mini story, a little bit of silk. Which I'm happy to see her coming back. Why is it that this seems different? I think my oh, oh, there it is. I got this back on the first hit. Spot Jessica Drew, Spider. Woman when she was pregnant. And then you got a few famous characters there. You can see a white rabbit right away. The walrus, which I thought he wouldn't. No, wait, no, he wasn't the one that went straight. And I don't know who the other one is. You got the web warriors. Okay, here's the Miles one. Got Ox from back in the Enforcers. Of course, this brings in one of the most hate my most hated characters, new characters ever, Regent. Which I could, yeah. I'm sorry, I hated Sob. It's okay, not bad, not bad. Also, can okay, we got a cool Alex Ross cover. Of course, he's long other other things right now. Good old Spidey. Here, I'll go ahead. Next book, which also felt big. Okay, we got a Star Wars ad here. I will it says on a bunch of repeats. So we got a Star Wars ad, so I know it's a Star Wars book. We got, oh boy. Star Wars Vader down. I think I had a director's cut of this, but I think... Yeah, okay. So no, I don't think I had this one. I think I had regular Darth Vader. really good though. So okay, there is one. It's the Walmart ones I haven't seen very many. I didn't see that one that's been out now. There's a little bit of the artwork. Not too bad. Pretty cool. So that's a new one for me. I don't think I had Vader down. He had a regular Darth Vader. Our last one is I showed. Eh, yeah, that was a <laughs> I thought it was another issue. I do have this one because it introduces the Black Punisher. <laughs> yes, I'm not lying. Nigel Higgins is his name, I believe. Yep. He's the UK United Kingdom Punisher from an alternate universe. He doesn't kill. <laughs> That's one thing. He actually does. 
Tigers one. <laughs> Uses rubber bulls and he knocks guys out. <laughs> so yeah, so got venom and that in there. So okay. So I got two doubles and one I didn't have out of that one. So that's alright. That's how I took a couple, right? Got some thing of grab bags. Maybe that was an old one that somebody just found. I don't know. Next, I did get the latest Adapu USA. I always pick these up. I just wonder about one thing. Oh, crap. Okay, seriously? I'm going to be spending some money for that set. So, any One Piece fans, there's one whole new set of figure art zeros. I'm sorry, but those are cool. <laughs> Especially like in Brook. That Wano arc has been freaking fun. Okay. No, I actually think I saw Nico Robin already. But I know for a fact I want Nami. <laughs> Come on, everybody wants to know me. <laughs> Got some of the other characters in there. The princess that's shacked up with Zoro. I know we're making Sanji jealous. Let's see. Got a new big Sailor Moon in there. Let's see here. I want to see who they got for cosplays. I'm wondering how they're pulling that off. You must see some old photos or something people sent in. I always like looking at cosplay. Let me know if you recognize anybody. I'm going to show those off. Because I know Annie Mae does her things. Because I know there's a few I probably should recognize, but <laughs> I follow a bunch online. <laughs> Cosplayers, but it's hard to recognize some people anymore. Because, you know, you don't see the convention pictures. Let's see, our manga inserts. Let's see, manga reviews. Let's see what our mangas are. Let me get another so I can see. Okay, so we got... Life Lessons for Yuromachi Odisan and Zom 100 Bucket List of the Dead. And funny in the artwork, a guy looks like Jughead. <laughs> so there's that. There's your two manga inserts. Now some of the ones that, you know, Time of Life ones I do kind of enjoy. You kind of break from all the fighting, right? Especially when the artwork is nice. And that actually looks good. This guy's art looks familiar. Who's the artist? Well, Kodenshi. I know Kodenshi from something. Okay, now Zom. Oh boy. Now that artist looks familiar. Who is that? Bit? Well, from Viz. Kodotoro. Oh, I ain't gonna be able to pronounce that name. Let me know if you recognize the art. Oh, wait. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not on the actual page. There's a little bit of the artwork. <laughs> I recognize that style. Of course, there's a few that are starting to look alike. But, yeah. Uh, oh boy. And that not give you Resident Evil vibes. <laughs> This doesn't look like somebody that zombies very often, the artist. It's like first chapter indeed. And he's more worried about going to work. <laughs> okay, this looks like it'd be a fun read. Oh man. Yep, you got your zombie. So he was worried about going to work and bam, there you go. <laughs> Ain't that one of the main things you always think about in the zombie apocalypse, right? <laughs> I don't have to go to work anymore. <laughs> That's funny. I can't help it. <laughs> he says, I'm free. <laughs> and a bunch of zombies come. Okay, this, this book, that's going to be a fun read. That's going to be hilarious.
<laughs> He's one. <laughs> oh, okay. That's going to be a funny read. I ain't going to lie. I know it's got zombies. We've got day of life. <laughs> that's funny. Okay, so dark half. I heard nothing on that one. Yeah, that's going to be some interesting stuff in there. That's just from space, your battleship, Zeus, little gamma rock. You got Z What in the world? DC monster. Okay, I thought it was battleship. It's a new one here. I'm sorry, but that made me think of G Big G. That's actually Deep Sea Monster Rigo versus the Battleship Yamato. I know the bat. I know that one. The battleship. Hyrule Warrior, Age of Calamity. I want to still play that. Demon Souls, Fire Emblem, Collection of Saga, Final Fantasy Legend, Dimension Impact, Puyo Puyo Tetris 2. Okay. We'll pass the mod and see what some of the new stuff is. Okay, big Attack on Titan thing in here. I've yet to see any of that, to be honest with you. <laughs> oh, I've seen bits. Some videos and stuff. Look at the manga's backwards. I was looking for the one that they just showed. I'm surprised that's not listed in here. Yeah, so I'm not going to stick with this, guys. So we got Dr. Stone. That's the one with Wicked City. Okay, that was a freaking crazy movie I remember watching. Wicked City. Nutcracker Fantasy. Now that looks Rankin and Bass. I do not remember that one, though. Okay, Caitlin, Uncle Unicorns, do you remember that Nutcracker fantasy? That sure reminds me of Rankin and Bass style. Gotta ask you if you remember that one. And we got some of the other stuff there too. That looks like the Rat King right there. No, not the Ninja Turtle Rat King. I don't know why I remember that one. Girl, see, that's another one I've never seen. Girls on Panzer. Video taco box. But I didn't see a hobby, hobby, yeah, hobby life Japan thing in here. And a big taco box. I know I've been seeing a lot of people doing this. I think Rizzy and Rach they do it. Um, I say Elizabeth Rage has done it. Not Rumpus. Oh, okay. I like seeing when they finally do some good figures, especially some female characters for once. You know, like the guy heavy shows, Dragon Ball. I don't know, is that a Figma? That's a robot show. Back arrow, is that it? Okay, must be. I don't recognize that one. Hmm. Well, I might have to check that out. That sounds most interesting. Yeah, that's a new Doctor USA, everybody. There is that. Uh, I'll go over here. I'll be making a new pile. And <laughs> I'm a little late, but I finally got my calendar. Stranger Things. 16 month calendar, all artwork. I had a heyday. I was hoping to get a new Harley, but I thought, you know, I'm going to hit. I got to get it hung up, too. I think it's the same size. So, yeah, there's that. That's something down here, though. So, okay, where are we at? Oh, boy, I'm already going too far. I still got a lot more to do. So, anyway, after that. What the heck is on me? Uh, I'm not going to find a home for this. Cause not. So after that, I took a long trip up to the mall after getting lunch today. And I went into Hot Topic to try to see if I have any like finding ECC. You know who, because I still got to get some other seasons of it too. But I was actually very, very, very surprised I found him. And I got Buffed Chopper. Very happy to find too, I'll be honest and say. They had a few actually, I was surprised, you know, because online it was sold out. I will get into something later by trying to find another one I wanted at a certain store, Wally World. 
and they have never stocked anything yet. Yeah, I definitely want to get chopper. I wonder if I got a seine. Huh. They usually have a seine on here. No, nope, no quotes. Oh man, I'm trying not to tear the box. <laughs> See everybody do that real easily. I oh, got a little tear in it. Shit. Boy, what's with the box? Really, really. Uh, get in there. Ooh, he is. He's got some weight to him. So yeah, I never saw the sticker. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm gonna show off all the. So there's the side. We can see his face a little bit better. Side artwork. And back of the thing, which I missed out on getting those because I don't know what I really don't know what happened. <laughs> now I'm trying to backtrack to get them and loose up and sneak the robin about crazy priced. This will be a long video, I just know it, and I didn't mean to. And I actually had to re watch the show, you know, because I gotta see when he actually did this look. He looks really good. I might end up trying to get back and doing a spinner on the end of this. Maybe. I don't know. I keep forgetting I got it. Cause that's what's holding my camera right now. So there he goes. He looks really good. I mean, I'm really surprised. You know, though, I am expecting. I'm going to say it right now. And who's with me? Comments below. Tell me. You think they might end up re-releasing him and flocked? I, I could see this being a plot like on Funimation. Really could. See, I always thought maybe he had a little bit of his antlers sticking up in the back. I like it though. I mean, I'm very surprised. Oh, I'm trying to see. That does. I heard somebody talk about how they don't feel like vinyl anymore. It's like plastic. It does look like you could have a waist swivel. Way it's, you can see the connection joint. You can kind of see where it connects a little bit because there is like it looks like a small gap. Yeah, I know I'm touching Chopper's butt. <laughs> I'm just showing because it looks like a small slit right here because it looks like it'd have a waist swivel because his head I know it does not move at all. He stands very well. Let me try to get it lined up. That's, that's how I'd have him. But the others, I Wish I remember the arc this was in. Like I said, I remember watching it was on. Yeah, four kids. <laughs> and then back when it was on Toonami and was watching it. I know I got all. I did have I think the entire Sky Pia run and the original disc set that they put out. But then you know they twit went around. I thought, well, heck, I will And then it, I think was where I was going to quit ordering them in. So yeah, there's Chopper. We're trying to stick him. I've got a couple more. And while I was looking around, I saw one of these. I think I don't usually do ad icons, but I do remember these. And I don't even know if these are still being made. But I thought, ah, what the heck. And it's funny because I kept having a mixture. That's something I'm going to get to in a little bit. And I did get the scented slush puppy. I know probably a lot of people would have gone with the flock. But, hey, I was there. <laughs> I couldn't think of any others I really wanted to pick up, and I saw all the new Marvel Zombie ones. Even the She Hulk, I'm thinking, oh man, I'm going to really dive into that. <laughs> but I didn't see any of the others. Oh, he opens up easy. That's always weird to me. Oh, forgot to show the box again. <laughs> and he fell right out. So here goes the box here. Side there. Back artwork. I remember, didn't Kmart have slush puppies? I remember it was more of the actual all ice compared to the icy. Especially now, the new icy, I don't like. Top and bottom. And look, I got it. <laughs> now, nah, I'm not going to get it that way. I know some people do that. Where's a scratch and sniff? Nope. Uh, I got to get it for a minute. <clears throat> Okay. Here he comes out of the package. 
That's definitely a good little mascot. Now this, I know, I can smell. It doesn't really smell like what I remember. A little paint. Scuff on. That's funny, it's got my freaking birthday on the back. That's weird. Yeah, he looks pretty dang good. Got the little beanie tap. That tongue. I remember many dogs used to do that. Yeah, so he looks pretty good. Okay. I'm trying to do this in order now. After I went in the Hot Topic, I went over to FYE looking around. Oh yeah, if I Hot Topic did have one soda I saw, but that was Scott Pilgrim. I don't know jack about that, so I didn't even bother with it. <laughs> and FOE, I found something because my DVD is really getting bad. <laughs> and I said to myself, I gotta get that. So I did pick up the Shonda Dead Steel Book on Blu-ray. I, I had to pick that up. <laughs> crack this open right now. Some of these don't take a break. So I want to see if there's anything special inside. Oh yeah, it's on the price. Regular price was 20 bucks. I got it on sale for $6.99. That <laughs> yeah that's the only other reason I say I ain't passing that up. <laughs> So you got a little card they got in here as well. It's gonna be a long video now. I didn't mean to make it this long, but oh well. That's what happened. So yeah, I got this little back here. So that's got all your usual information. So I guess it stays on. I like to take it off myself because I want to see the actual thing. I think it's got a lot of the same bonus features and all that kind of stuff. Let's see the discs though. You got that there. You got your front here. I don't know Sean's cover because this is taped on. You got the couple of zombies, which I don't recognize actually any here. <laughs> well, I gotta hurry up. It's 6:30. A great image of Nick Frost and Sean Penn in there. Then you got your disc. I like this a lot more than the DVD one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was a must. That was a must buy. So, now I'm driving all the way home. <laughs> yeah, a lot of driving today. Little wonder I'm tired. Yeah, I did get over to Wally World. I saw all these earlier in the week because... My grandma was trying to find something. I'm not gonna get into that. But they had some new comic packs for DC. So I picked up the one with the Future State Harley Quinn. You know, that's about sending Batman 102. I tell you, if I end up pulling a Batman 100 out of one of these, I'm gonna be shocked. But we're gonna go ahead and get those cracked open because this is already going 20 minutes. And I don't want this to run out because I really want to get it done. Where's my scissors? No, I'm gonna get the other thing. That's when it gets to work. Okay. I'll try this in a hurry. Move the pops over here so you guys can see. Okay. Last book. And let's try to open the Harley Quinn. I'm not going to look through them. So I'm just show them off. Okay. Oh shit. Did I go through? No, I didn't. So we got a little Shazam. Adam Kubert School. Add on the back, so that's new to me. And we got what is this? Teen Titans number 40. That's actually pretty cool. I don't know much on the new or Teen Titans. Where's that? A little bit there. Okay. That's not my 25 minute marker. I'm sorry about that. Okay, another book here. Regal Cinema. I don't even know if we have any of those anymore. Yet. Huh, another Teen Titan book. Teen... Okay, that's funny. 39. Well, we got 40. And this is 39. That's funny. Very funny. Just show that off there. Okay. Okay, next one here. Okay, this is a special book. 
I hope I don't have this already. We have the Superman ad, and we got. Ooh, okay, good. Here, the villain Lex Luthor. Oh wow, Action Comics. Ten seventeen. Here's your inside cover. Wow. <laughs> wow. Okay, that's that's awesome looking. Glass. So here's no John Romolta artwork. I think. Yep. J R J R. Yeah. Okay. There's that. Our last book. Of course, we all know what that is. If I can get her out of there. <laughs> Why is it hanging on this time? Come on now. Ooh, got a sketch poster. That's quite cool. I think it's a, it's a Justice League cover. And we got a Harley Quinn Future State number one. A big Nightwing advertisement there. So I'll just show off a little bit of the artwork. Okay, now on to the next. I'll get this out here so I can show this off a little bit better. I did cut through it. <laughs> They had a bunch of ones for Legion. I mean, I already got a bunch of books for that. Some of the other ones. Crap, I didn't get through. I'm trying to hurry because I want to get ready for bed right after I get done here. I am tired. I'm not popping on a live. I don't know who's live tonight because I got a bunch of. <laughs> Live, I set reminders for them. like, oh man, I'm gonna forget about these, mm -hmm. or I'm gonna get messed up. So, I might be doing a lot of live hopping. I'm just being honest. Okay, so, okay, that's new. it's the new Don. So, that, seen it? Oh, Batman, Superman, number 11, Ultra Humanite. Man, I haven't seen him in a long time. Okay, okay, usually I get mad about some of the new looks, but he doesn't look too bad. All right, there goes that. I'm not gonna split them up tonight either. I usually split them up. I know. Okay, this hat I remember. Playface, Batman, Adam Kubert, and we got. That's going to be my double pile. Justice League 44. I got. I think now that's my fourth of that. Okay, got a tenant ad. I don't know who we got on the front. Ooh, the Flash 756. It's your funeral next. Oh boy, who is this? It's Barry Allen. I'll find out who's freaking funeral. Goldie Glider? Why don't you bring her back to life? So you got Captain. So you got a lot of the rogues in this. I like that. I do like that cover showing there, all his rogues too. So I wonder who is in there. So it was a, Zoom was supposed to get his family, so I think that's the start of that story. I like your artwork on this one, you know, the new Wally looks very weird. There's a little bit more. Okay, anyway, let's get the Batman. I think it's the last one. Yep. Batman 102. So, no luck getting more of the Joker War. There's that. Got our ad here showing the what's coming. So, we got a lot of other things. This is introducing the Ghost Maker. Or maybe 101 did. That there is a little something. Might be a spoiler, but you got to order a full back. The artist, who's like that, George? Oh, no, it's a different artist in this issue today. We got Harley in here. All right. I was going to show my favorite little clown girl. <laughs> Yeah, so that's, and okay, lastly, that's the books. All my DC books I got, I'm happy to get one I didn't have. And lastly, I went over to GameStop afterwards. 
<sighs> I saw one pop of Budagrad. They had a sale, three, buy three, get one free. I think up on FOE, though, they had buy two, get one free, but I didn't see anything I really, really wanted. But I saw this, I'm thinking, I'm surprised this ain't the exclusive, but I'm actually glad it isn't. Got the My Hero Academia Mina Ashido. Hope I'm pronouncing that name right. <laughs> and yeah, this was a must get. Now, Bruno really, this character's really grown on me a lot from what I've seen. Even in the movie, Heroes, was it Heroes Rising or Two Heroes? I think it was Heroes Rising, that was the second movie. She was a bummer. I mean, everybody in there had a moment. I mean, my God, that movie got me going. I mean, I have a certain other show doesn't do that for me anymore. I mean, yeah, you were this show had you worried. I thought people were going to die. I've seen other people get that the um, exclusive. All my Batman, all my comics are on me in a way, but I'll try that out here. There she goes out of box. I like that little, her little effect. Is that burning? <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to quit just showing that off. That's my haul, guys. Hope enjoyed. I mean, I'm really happy about all this I picked up today. Read the description down below. Check out a lot of channels. There's a bunch that's got goals going on. I have Patriot Prime, Cadence Collection, Deluxe Baldwin. The other reject the cons and many more. Like, comment, subscribe, and the notification bell. Learn how to that's all learn how to love, forget how to hate, be kind to one another, be excellent to each other, and party on, dudes! Rock on!